More sad news from the world of sports. The Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship was KO'd temporarily in Wichita, Kansas, the nation's air capital, by the global virus pandemic, leaving the community and the fighters on the card shocked and searching for hope. Everybody's wrote down about the fight being canceled. Everybody was talking about the fight. Um, it's pretty, it's pretty heartbreaking. I'm, I'm sad about it. It's, it's devastating, it's like I, a friend died. All the promises I made, you know, not just to uh, people that was coming to watch, fans and family, you know, who wanted to see this fight, you know. Uh, you know, I got kids, I got daughters who got birthdays coming up that I was planning to do things with the money that I was gonna make from this, you know, this fight. It was a main event, you know, this has been the biggest payday I've made in combat sports, you know. BKFC David Feldman posted this on his company's Instagram account, saying, with the health and safety concerns of everyone involved and the mandate carried out by officials, it is unfortunate that we were not able to put on BKFC 11, which would have been our highest attended event yet. We have rescheduled the event for Saturday, June 20th. Our thoughts and prayers are with everybody affected at this difficult time. It was going to be excited. Everybody's excited. I'm excited to, to fight here. I'm excited to fight alongside my friends and uh, you know brothers in arms. So it was going to be it was going to be amazing. People are just like you know pissed off for lack of a better term about it. You know. City streets were quiet on way in Friday, and so was the Interest Arena and box office, with a Saturday event promo still playing on the big screens. This is a pretty crazy thing that's going on really in the world in general right now and to be directly affected in this way. I mean, I, I sold over 500 tickets for the event, hand to fist. Uh, these are people in my community. These are my friends, fans, family. Bare Knuckle News was at Genesis Health Club's boxing pro and to speak with trainer Andy Zerger, who was going to be cornering four fighters in the BKFC 11's card. Frustration for sure. Yeah, I definitely spent time uh, uh, training some of these guys. Um, you know, the community was going to make a few dollars, the fighters were going to make a few dollars. The ending result um, isn't going to happen. You know, like we're not going to exactly see how these guys uh, did. You know, you know, what do you do? You know? The training and everything that went into it had me excited. I was fired up. I was, I'm like, this, I'm going to love this. I'm going to fall in love with this sport. And now I got a bad taste in my mouth. You know what I mean? I don't get to get in there, I don't get to try it out. I gotta wait a little bit longer. I gotta diet a little bit longer. Um, I have to dig deep and find some more motivation. So nothing I can do except keep on training and just keep on trying to get better. For Bare Knuckle News, I'm Susan Singara reporting. And remember, every fighter has a story.